Speaking of exciting stuff, Pickle. More exciting stuff. It's time for a, 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 a semi-regular segment here on this show. Mm-hmm. It's our uh, it's our intern exit interview. Yes. So intern whenever whenever. Uh, My first time to be a part of an intern exit interview. Whenever we have an intern that finishes an internship, we like to have them on to, um, you know, round out the internship and, and get their feel, uh, for for what we did right, what we did wrong, how we can improve, um, and so that's what we're here to do, and we're joined. Uh, right now, over the Dave Campbell's Texas Football, Texas Football Today, Greg Powers Memorial Power Zone, joined by Mallory Hartley, our intern. Hi, Mallory. Hello. It's good to be here. I feel like I'm kind of on the Ellen Show, but <laughs> the sports version of the Ellen Show, the better version of the Ellen Show. Like this chair. I, so, so does that does that make me Ellen DeGeneres, and does that make Pickle Twitch? Yeah. I'm down to be Twitch. And yes, I do know who that is. My <laughs> wife watches Ellen. Uh, my wife. <laughs> um, so welcome in. You've been interning with us. First of all, let's get some some background. You are from Arlington. Yes. You attend uh, the University of North Texas. Cool. Of course. You know I was repping the day. Just the worst. There you go. My God, I'm the best duo. <laughs> let's go. If you Tucker guys hates wonder, it. If, if you guys if you guys wonder why I always look so tired. Um, so, so you, now what are you studying at North Texas? I'm studying converged broadcast and media, kind of the same thing that Ashley did. The exact same degree. Yeah, the same program, same courses, same professors. Okay. Yeah. All right. So she, so basically she saved all of her tests and she's just like giving them to you. Hey, 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 she's still in school. Yeah. Last semester. Don't be putting that out there yet. That comes out after graduation. You can say no. Like no. you can okay, there you go. No, wow, that's deniable. I'm a very honest person. I do yeah. not cheat. Right. We don't hire. We don't hire no. dishonest people as interns here at Dave. It's Gant part of my Texas background football. check. Right, exactly. <laughs> the the rigorous background check, check that, that we do, <laughs> which was we held a mirror up to your nose and asked you to fog it. Um, so, so what do you want to be when you grow up? Oh man, this job has really made me change my mind. I have really <laughs> not in she a says, bad way. She said, throw it all away. Like, not in know, a bad way. I hate you know, all of I it. I kind of thought that I wanted to do something like host an internet show, and then I saw this, and I'm like, <laughs> I could not run, run away from the time. Absolutely. <laughs> the mediocre show. No, 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 no. I meant in terms of like, I, I've done a lot of editing here, and I, I really enjoy it. I've, I've cut the show into segments that's pretty much my main job here, mm-hmm. and I really enjoyed that. You know, I, I, I would like. You know, my main goal is probably to be a sideline reporter mm-hmm. um, somewhere. Prefer I my main goal probably is to get to the Big Ten Network somewhere. That's I don't right. know that I've told I told you that at the beginning of because I'm a big Michigan State fan. Yeah, and, that's you know. and I do want to go there for a moment. That you have <laughs> let's a, talk right, about yes. those you jerseys. A, you have a you have a, a, a an affinity for the Spartans. I you're do. like you're one of like three Michigan State fans, fans. I've ever met. <laughs> Huge, um, and I'm very loyal too. Like that, it, she's loyal. loyal to a fault. She, she didn't. But you didn't enjoy the jerseys, though. Can no. we Can we bring up the jersey issue? The dark green with the, the it says lime state green. Really big on the. Yeah, it's bad. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not. Good. Um, why Michigan State? My dad went there. Ah, uh, okay. So, mm-hmm. I mean, there's a video actually of me. I was like three months old. My dad's holding me, and he's just looking at me and talking to me about the tournament in Michigan State. Mm -hmm. This was like in March. You know, I was like three months old, and he's just talking to me about Michigan State and the the NCAA tournament. And so that's – my mom's like, that's the moment right there that you were just completely brainwashed. Yeah, (laughs) that's – you know, it happens. I was like, yeah. It it, it was. It happens It's like Hank with the Rangers. Almost certainly. He says go Rangers, by the way. You should know this. Okay. He does say this. We're moving up. Uh, That's fine. Um, okay, so now you do uh, also do some work with our friends over there at Friday Night Stars. You are yes. a sideline reporter. Um, do do you and and you said that that's probably something that you would like to pursue in the future. You do like sideline reporting. I do. I love being on the sidelines a lot. I love being in the action too. And mm-hmm. part of my job over there is to also take highlights. And man, it, there's nothing better when you're right there to get the perfect highlight. You know, and she ended it's, up on the Max Prep Instagram. St- I uh, did feed the other day, like the official, official Max Prep one. DeMarco Roberts, you know, mm-hmm. Alito's running back, hurtled into the end zone, and I was right there to get it. And 
Max Pipes picked it up. Hot diggity darn. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Okay. Dude, that we're was a do it. perfect we're, we're moment. Doing our, we're doing our exit interview with our intern, Mallory Hartley, here on Text Football today. Get involved in the conversation. Hashtag TF today. Um, okay. So you, you are a, a sideline reporter. You've done some sideline reporting. Uh, we actually have a professional sideline reporter here. As you know, you've met Ashley Pickle. I think I've met her before. Yes. That's She's she- only my actual legend yes like she exactly. she is truly for sure i look yes Res- yeah course. no yeah you, everyone kneels at the altar so <laughs> so so th- i thought that this was an interesting uh, an interesting opportunity for for us uh we have a clip here uh of of you doing some sideline reporting let's go ahead and roll the clip and oh, then we'll geez. get some we'll get some post game okay it is halftime here at Joy and Ralph Ellis Stadium in Irving is leading Richardson three to zero. And as you can tell, there hasn't been much scoring going on in this game other than Irving's field goal early earlier in this first half. But that is not the story for tonight. Irving's defense has been completely dominant in this game holding Richardson to just 69 rushing yards and forcing two turnovers already in this first half, one fumble recovery. And then there was one interception in the end zone that ended this first half. And that interception was made by uh, Irving's Jacob Vine. It Mm -hmm. has been such a great game to watch and very defense heavy. And it's, I'm really excited to see what this game is going to play out to be. But you can stay updated with this game through my Twitter page or Friday Night Stars or a game on sports. Okay, so I have two questions, one for you and one for you. Mm-hmm. The first for you, did you see any actual good games this year? Because that was 3 <laughs> nothing at <laughs> halftime, and i got to be honest. That Actually, the end of that game, it ended up being 7-3 to three Richardson. Mm. And it was exciting because – you know, Irving hasn't won a game mm-hmm. in a while, and it was exciting because we thought maybe that was gonna be that was gonna be it. That mm-hmm. that was gonna break their losing streak. Sure. But th- that was pretty exciting. Okay. You know, I gotta be honest. Three nothing doesn't sound fun to me. Yeah. You're not you're a not a fan of those defensive all just, out brawls. And, and so yeah. now Tepper I, likes high flying spritz. And so now <laughs> now I want to go over to our the the professional over here, and I want to get some 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 takes from you. What how do you feel that that went? The sideline reporting yeah. or the game? Sideline reporting. <laughs> okay. No, the sideline reporting is great. I love that Mallory has the ease of talking to someone like she's talking to a friend on camera. A lot of times, too many people on the sideline, I feel, try to get way too robotic with it. And she does a really, really good job of, like in here, just talking. You're there. You're telling people the experience. And that's that's a thing that can't really be taught. You have to do it, and you kind of have to have some – some natural, comfortable talent with it, and she's got that. Uh, I yeah, I agree. I'm not a sideline reporter, so I wouldn't know. I've yeah, done, you and your climate controlled studios. I've done have one. I did no do idea. one sideline reporting for a state semifinal in 2000 and. Oh, can we find this clip? Twelve. It exists. I would love to um, see it. I would. Yeah. 2012. It was Sybil of Steel and 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 and, and Katie in Waco, and I interviewed Gary Joseph after the game. I always remember that. Anyway, that's not here nor there. Um. Okay, so you went to Arlington High. You're a Colt. Oh, yes. I'm mm-hmm. so proud, too. So proud of my Colts. <laughs> You're a proud Colt. <laughs> I am. Um, so you were I'm, – I'm, I'm trying to get a read on, on you in, in this way because you were the varsity cheer captain. I was. Right? You yeah. were, <laughs> but you were also in the National Honor Society. Was. And you were in the Key Club. Yes. And you were on the newspaper staff. Yes, my senior year, I was the sports writer, so I got right. to interview a couple of my friends on the team, and that was yeah. pretty cool. So here's yeah. the thing that I can't understand, because I was on the newspaper staff, but there was no doubting as to whether or not I was a, a dork. Nerd! Like that, was, that was very clear to everybody involved. It still is. Things haven't changed. You were both varsity cheer captain <laughs> and on the newspaper staff. So I guess, my, like, I just don't know. Like, are, are you a dork? How do you balance nerd? Yeah, how, do you, how do you balance that? <laughs> what, co- yeah, what's the scale between, like, nerd and popular? Like, I, I don't know. You tell Ooh, me. She's- I've never known one of those. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you're an enigma <laughs> in Tepper's eyes. Yeah. How can you be cool and nerdy at the same time? How can you be on the time? cheer team but on the newspaper? It doesn't, <laughs> it doesn't make any work. sense to me. It doesn't work. <laughs> no, it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Tepper, Tepper was like... You got the dud. I really am. <laughs> you, you are the dud. <laughs> um, you're, a new okay. year, you're a New Year's baby. Yes, almost. When were you Jesus. born? The 30th. Do you know her social security number, too? 
I'm sorry. Did you think that this was? Did you think this was just going to be like a? I was coming no. unprepared to this. Yeah, here's your whole life story, your Mallory. Year, your New Year's baby. <laughs> yes, and I came into the office on my birthday, but you guys weren't here. Yeah. <laughs> We, Sorry, I shouldn't laugh suck. at that, but it's like, oh, well. Uh, I did a lot of packaging. Happy uh, birthday. birthday. <laughs> it was um, good. It was from, really good. From us to you. Yeah, really. Uh, I enjoyed it. Yeah, your, your birthday gives us some paper or yeah. some, some paper cuts. Um, <laughs> so were you born like in the, first of all, it's 31st and not the first, right? 30th. Thir- oh, 30th. Oh, your oh. research failed you, dud. Almost. Well, eh. I was actually supposed to be born in like January. But okay. so you yeah. came early. See, I thought that, uh, I don't my know. dad wanted the, the tax break or whatever. No, that so no, makes yeah. sense. I, I knew. <laughs> I, I wished her happy birthday that morning because I knew yes. I wasn't going to be here. That was Cotton Bowl day. Yeah, she, yeah she was. I knew so, you weren't going to be here. And I figured Tepper wasn't going to be here either. Cause you have I ain't working. <laughs> You're asking me to work? Come on. Um, but it was my birthday. Okay. Come on, Tepper. I want to ask you for another uh, scouting report. You're a football expert. You're somebody who, who swims in the soup of football. Uh, last year at Arlington Lamar, there was a linebacker named Joey Hartley. Mm-hmm. How would you? How would you say? What? What would you? What, what kind? Give me a scouting report on Joey Hartley, the linebacker. I don't know him too well. Uh-huh. No, I'm just kidding. He's a actually blood related. Sure. Brother. Yes. <laughs> okay. Man, he was a uh, definitely. Yeah. Funny story. He actually went to Lamar his mm-hmm. freshman or no Arlington. My bad. He went to Arlington his freshman and sophomore year. Mm-hmm. He transferred to Lamar his junior year, didn't play football, came back his senior year, and Coach DeLay started him as a How linebacker. He's a stud. We like, we like Coach DeLay around oh here. Oh, man. We do. He's, he's the um, best. He really is. But, yeah, he's a stud. Oh. He's not playing football right now, but mm. he's a – So I'm getting this great. Twitter alert for those who don't know, and I guess I'll, I'll ask you about it because we got it here. But we got some breaking college football coaching news. It appears that uh, Travis James – has been appointed the interim head coach at Rhodes College in Tennessee. Your breakdown of the hire <laughs> for Rhodes College with Travis James being appointed the interim coach. I actually found out that their head coach was – He resigned. He, he resigned think. yesterday, yes. He wanted to spend more time with his family mm-hmm. and stuff like that, but I'm a huge – you're big Rhodes Rhodes College. College it's, 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 Mich- it's Michigan State and Rhodes, Rhodes College. There's in no some, in between. It's in some just, order. Yes, yes. It, 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 you know, it depends on who's having the better. I team. think they're really excited about him too. You know, sure. I, I think he's a he's going to be a good fit for the job, and I know they're going to miss you know their, their coach Ryan, but mm-hmm. I think they're really excited over in good old Memphis, Tennessee for <laughs> for the new coach. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Okay, and so finally to round it all out. <laughs> um, did you did you enjoy your internship? Did you have? A, would you recommend this on a like oh give, give it like a star it. scale, like this one to five star? Cracks like, knuckles. This is when the tip. This is where begins. I'm gonna go off imagine, right now. <laughs> imagine that we were Yelp, right? Okay. And you're giving Dave Campbell's Texas football an internship at Dave Campbell's Texas football a Yelp score. Let's hear your Yelp review. Can I be sappy, like sweet and nice to you? You can have Not to okay. Tepper. Have, I don't allow that you around have, these parts. Look, look the, the floor is yours. yours. Okay. <laughs> Truly, this internship has given me everything that I could have ever wanted. I mean, some of the best experience I could have gotten with some of the best people that I could work with. I mean, truly, it was a blessing that I got this internship, for sure. I mean, I was kind of looking for one in the summer. Uh, my mom actually sent me the post that Ashley retweeted saying that <laughs> – they're looking for an internship, and I was like, that would be really c- – I was already in the Texas high school football game anyway, mm-hmm. and so I was like, I could really learn more, a lot more, you know, here. And so I ended up applying, and I got it, and truly – and it's been a long one, too, all the way till January, which yeah. usually isn't how it goes. No, but normally we run you out. No, normally, Like yeah. November. You know, it's kind of yeah. like whenever you leave something in the fridge too long, you know what yeah. I mean? It's just like it gets past its expiration date. We're like, mm, I don't know. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> But well, I mean, it's been it's been incredible. Well, I can't thank you guys enough. Well, Mallory, it, 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 in all honesty, you've been such a great help around here. You've been a fantastic member of the team. We really appreciate. It. We could not have. Twenty twenty was obviously extremely difficult for for everybody involved, but we could not have gotten it through gotten through it without you. So I, on behalf of Dave Campbell's Texas Football, want to thank you for your contributions and what you've been able to do. And I believe your this name is painting him I very bad name, to be I was nice like, am I finally someone? on Tepper's good side? I was going to say, he's, he's being nice to a mean <laughs> green person here. And this is visually like 
pain in his face here. Well, yeah, but then I can balance it out by just being mean to you. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, so I'll be nice to you. But right. again, yeah, like legitimately, I would not have been able to get near as much any sleep, honestly, if you weren't here. So thank you for everything you did. You've got a bright future ahead of you, and Jeez. we're excited to be a part of it. And you've got one more semester at North Texas, right? I do. Just started yesterday. Oh gosh. Had my first class, so mm. yeah, ka. We're yeah, we're painting this. Uh, we're painting this office green over here. That's going to do it for us. <laughs> Mallory Hartley, thank you so much for uh, for all your work this uh, this this fall. Is that what this season fall is? This slash year. I mean, fall. spring. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Every, all of it. That's all fine. of it. Exactly. Something like that. But really, thank you guys a it's, lot. For but everything. there's one last thing you have to do for your internship, mm -hmm. and that is this. That's going to do it for us. Thanks for spending a little bit of your day with us. Follow us on Twitter at DCTF. Like us on Facebook, Facebook.com slash Dave Campbell's. Follow us on Instagram, Instagram.com slash Dave Campbell's. And, of course, see us at TexasFootball.com. 